असलम बॉयज़ एंड गर्ल्स कैसे हैं आप मैं बिल्कुल ठीक ठाक राइट दिस वीडियो इज़ लाइक अ शॉर्ट वीडियो अबाउट हाउ टू गेट द मॉडल्स फ्राम गिट हब एंड देन रन इट ऑन योर सिस्टम बिकॉज आई गॉट अ कॉमेंट फ्राम स्टनिंग थ्री सिक्स नाइन टू एट आई एम सॉरी फैम फैम नॉट प्रोनाउंसिंग इट करेक्टली एंड टर्न आउट सम ऑफ यू आर हैविंग प्रॉब्लम्स डाउनलोडिंग द कोड फ्राम द गिट हब एंड मॉडल फ्राम द गिट हब एंड देन रनिंग इट so let's see how to do that so where, like uh, under one uh, under like uh, my videos there is a link of github so you'll go there after going there you can just download uh, the code which has like the code and all the files so it has the face recognition code this is the code this is the attendance excel file this is the database which has like all the pictures of me bill uh, bill gates and elon musk and all that and this is the liveness model which checks for liveness right So you, so you can go there and download the zip file so you can download it anywhere so i'm going to download it download it in like the main repository you can download it anywhere you want right so now i have downloaded it now what i can do is i can execute my anaconda prompt so over so first i'll activate my environment Conda env list. It's not Conda list env. It's Conda env list. All right. So Conda env list, and we have face recog attendance, right? So I'm gonna activate this environment, the face recog attendance. So a t t n d n c e. If you like, if you have like, uh, please follow this tutorial after watching all the videos because we have already in like in like the previous like the in part one. uh we created this environment and installed all the necessary packages into it so if you are following this right now make sure you watch video 1 and download all the necessary packages like make the environment and download all the necessary package into it so i'm going to activate that environment which has all the necessary packages into it after that i'm going to execute jupyter notebook so i'm going to go jupyter notebook right while it is executing jupyter notebook i'm going to go in the repository where where, uh, where it has the so i'm going to make a new folder i can just name it face recog right and i can copy this is the like the github uh, zip file i downloaded so i'm going to cut it and paste it here so we have like a clean repository then we are going to extract it i'm going to extract it right here right so now we have this it has like all the codes and everything right so it's g face recog facial recognition or like i can just copy it outside here so we can have this right so it's in face recog and uh, face recog attendance main right so it is here so i'm going to uh, like so i have executed my jupyter notebook after executing it i'm going to locate into the same working repository so it was in face recog g face recog face recog attendance main and it has all the code in database now if i run this code right now because uh, this code right now so it will be it will like execute normally what this code is going to do it this code is going to go in the database and look for all the folders so it knows that there are three perp like there, there are three people to recognize zan elon and bill gates right and the face the measurement of the face which are face facial embeddings these are all saved in a pickle file representations these, these are these are known as representations or embedding it's in pickle files so this the uh, this pickle file already has all the embeddings it has saved it so my so 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 the code won't uh, you know remeasure all the faces in the database it has all the measurements it, it is just going to compare these measurements uh, with the faces in the camera right So if I execute it right now, it is going to execute quite normally. So I'm going to restart it right now, and it is going to execute the whole code. So you see, so, so you can see it is working properly, right? So yes. So the so the topic of this video was that what if I want to add more faces? Uh, what I what what if I like add more people? Like for example, what if I want to add more faces into the database? all right so let's say i want uh, let's say i'm not able to detect myself very clearly and i want to add more representations to it to make like better representations 
or what if I want to add let's say Michael here or Arsalan here right so so now, now if you add another folder let's say if you add another folder and name it what's like another famous like Tom Cruise right so I, I like add another person Tom here and then I add some pictures of Tom Cruise here so if I write Tom Cruise right and I try to take some decent pictures of Tom Cruise so let's say this is a good picture so I just take this save image as and I try to save it on face recall face attendance means and database right and Tom so I, I save Tom Cruise's picture here right now if I like after adding this picture if I try to execute my code again it won't detect Tom Cruise right now since I, I don't have Tom Cruise in person and this code has a liveness check so there is a high probability that if I try to show Tom Cruise from my phone it won't detect Tom Cruise because it is a liveness check but if there is like another friend of yours I don't have like any one here right now with me which I can check but if you want to add another person so if you like if I execute like after like making these changes adding another person in the database if I execute my code again it won't detect for Tom Cruise why because we have to rewrite the pickle file which has all the representations right so in order to do that what what we need to do first we're gonna cancel it now if if you have added another picture of yours or someone else's picture or if you have you know added another person into the database you then need to delete the representations all right now I have deleted the representations now I'm going to execute the code again and see what happens so you see it will create all the representations here right so it, it created all the representation we again have this representation file so it created a new representation file and, and after like, while creating it it looked at all the faces or if, if there were new people or new pictures in the database right so that 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 how you add more people or more pictures in the database and update your picker file so it updates on its own right so that's how you do it so do let me know if you have any confusions so yeah see you next time